Please be seated. Let us pray. We thank you, God, for our life. And we thank you, O oh God, for the creation. We thank you for the cool nights and the open windows. We thank you for the kindnesses that you show to us in each person present, the love that we experience, the hope that we have for tomorrow. We thank you for our families, our families of birth that brought us to be, our families of vocation, the spouses and partners with whom you have called us to live and to move and to have our being. We thank you for our children, children by our own parentage, by adoption, by marriage, and we thank you for their children. We thank you for our families of choice, our dearest friends and colleagues, the people with whom we get to spend our moments and days and years, the people you've put into our path to bless us and for us to bless them. We thank you for our family of faith, your people of all the faiths throughout all the world. We thank you for our parent faiths of Judaism, Roman Catholicism, and the Reformers. We thank you for our family in today's Christian church in every country in the world, whether Catholic, Orthodox, or Protestant. And we thank you for our immediate faith family, the United Church of Christ, with its historic and consistent witness to the world of your demand for justice, equality, and fairness, regardless of race, ethnicity, gender, gender identity, sexual orientation, social class, or economic status regardless of our varied abilities of hearing, of seeing, of movement, or of thinking, and that you still call every single one of us your child. We are all your children. Be with our denomination in these hard times when our following the Jesus of love and acceptance puts us at odds with those in the church who believe you to be a God of exclusion, judgment, and punishment. We thank you, God, for this family, this family gathered and those who can't be with us today, for one another, the members of this congregation, a small group called together by you to do great things for you in this community and in this your world. We thank you for the freedom that we enjoy as free citizens in this country and patriots to demonstrate in support of or in opposition to our elected government. And we pray that this country might always remain a free people. We thank you for making us in your image for calling us to give Caesar only what is due to Caesar and to give to you all of that which has your image on it, our very selves, our lives, our talents, and our substance, and even our money with its pictures of former presidents who now live with you and with the inscription, in God we trust. May it be so. We come concerned for others whom we love, who are ill, and for the world, and for those who suffer from war, cruelty, famine, and natural disaster. We name them before you now. Stephen. Sheila. Maria. Okay. 
Thank you, O oh God, for hearing our prayers. Thank you for answering them in your time. We pray all these things that we believe Jesus would pray. And so we pray that they will be so in his name. Amen.